as a food explorer and a food lover that I am, today I start to show you how to make this yummy and delicious coconut flavored yam porridge. Hello foodies, it's under yummy o'clock once again. If you're new to my channel, I say a big welcome to you all. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please help click on the red subscribe button. Help click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I post any new video. And help like this video, help comment and help share this video to help reach more people. Let's help grow this channel. Because growing this channel really means a lot to me and for this shall we firstly you want to pour your washed green yam into your pot then you go in with your sliced onions some salt the star ingredients which is the coconut milk then you add your stock you can use any stock of your choice but if you don't have your stock you can totally skip it and you also just add some water just a little amount of water do then you want to just give everything a stage it is combined once it has combined you want to cover it to boil for 5 to 10 minutes after it has boiled for about 5 to 10 minutes you just want to stir it and you want to go ahead to add blended pepper and onion mix then you want to add a little amount of water just give it a stir to combine then you just want to add your crayfish powder then you give everything a stir to combine you just want to cover this to continue boiling once it has boiled more for about five minutes you want to add your seasoning to taste you want to add your cooked and set aside protein items smoked panla fish some more onions some palm oil then you just want to make sure you see everything together so it is properly combined. Once it has combined properly like this, then you want to just cover it to continue cooking. Once this has cooked for about 10 more minutes, you just want to stay to combine at some point because this yam is a dried yam. So I just had to use some stick to press it, to press some of it so that it will thicken up more. Because you know that this season it is dry yam that we have in season. So you just want to stir everything to combine once you have mashed it. Then you add your uziza leaf, you add some scent leaf. You want to just cover this to, to simmer for about three minutes. At this point, you just want to give this beauty a good stir, a good mix that is properly combined. Don't you love what you're saying? Are you sure to give this recipe a try? Because this recipe, it is a banger. It is a it for this at this point you just want to make sure you properly say it to combine you want everything to properly incorporate then you just want to go ahead to serve this pots of deliciousness and yumminess i'm telling you this this recipe is so good it's nice it's so good you're going to enjoy this recipe just make sure you give this recipe a try for this if you haven't subscribed to my channel if you're new to my channel please up click on the red subscribe button up like this video Help click on the notification bell, help comment and help share this video to help reach more people. And to all my returning subscribers, I say a big thank you to you all for always stopping by. For not getting tired of this channel. And for this, I hope to see you all again in my next video. Bye.